It was called the wedding of the century, Tom Cruise and Katie Holmes. The lavish ceremony was held at this fairy tale castle in Italy in 2006, and I was there. As you can see, the limos will pull up, the flash bulbs will flash, you can barely see who's in the car. Now we're learning shocking secrets about the Tomcat wedding from one of their guests, actress Leah Remini, author of a bombshell new memoir, Troublemaker, about her split from Scientology. Remini says she was invited to the wedding primarily so she would bring along her best friend Jennifer Lopez and then husband Mark Anthony. Here's what Remini told 2020. They wanted to make Jennifer a Scientologist. And there's this bizarre story. At the wedding reception, Leah Remini says the plaintive cries of a child could be heard by everyone. It was seven-month-old Suri Cruz, who Remini says was left crying on the floor of a bathroom with neither her parents nor the other guests showing any concern. Baby Suri only stopped crying after Remini says she convinced somebody to pick up the baby and give her a bottle of warm milk. I spoke I with former Scientologist Lori Hodson. You know, they believe that children are spiritual beings and that they uh, can handle a lot of responsibility, but I've never heard of that at such a young age as an infant. Remini, star of the CBS sitcom King of Queens, says Katie Holmes actually complained about her to Scientology leaders, detailing her unhappiness with Remini's sure, behavior uh, at the it wedding. It starts with, I was dismayed at the behavior of Leah Remini during the events leading up to our wedding and our wedding. Katie, who divorced Tom Cruise in 2012, is now apologizing. I regret having upset Leah in the past and wish her only the best in the future, she said in a statement. Remini yeah, fought yeah, back we tears on Monday's Good Morning people. America, no talking about Katie's through. apology. I've seen her and Suri sir, um, out there in the world and, and her being able to be with her daughter and live her life is, you know, I'm touched by it. Remini says the Tomcat wedding was the point where she began to question her commitment to Scientology.